the Army today. Spotlighting the NCO in Afghanistan. Gail McCabe reports. For here in Afghanistan, uh, it, it's where you can see the applications of what we have been training our NCOs for, for years. In the past seven, eight years, uh, they have done it quite well and even better today. They're seen uh, throughout the world, especially here in, in Afghanistan with the different uh, international community that are part of this fight. Uh, they're seeing what the what this system that we have in the Army, this person that we call a non-commissioned officer, he is leading the fight today from the team leader level, squad, platoon, first shot level, where the fight is at today. And they're the one that's applying all the tactics and, and procedures that we have taught that have caused the international community, all these militaries, to look and say, hey, who is this person? And, uh, why is he so effective? Why is he the person that's carrying the fight, leading the fight? And uh, why isn't an officer out front in doing this? It's because of the system, uh, because of what we have done for years in training our non-commissioned officers to instill the confidence in them, uh, to ensure that in times like this, they're able to apply what they have learned and how to lead soldiers with the right type of values and the right type of leadership that it takes for that particular soldier to put all he can, all she can, uh, into accomplishing uh, the mission. They could not have selected a better year to do this in because of what our non-commissioned officers have been doing uh, for years now and how they're applying it and where it counts in a combat zone. That's the Army Today from Soldiers Radio and Television in Washington.